Good evening and welcome to the first ever virtual senior night. Class of 2020, tonight we recognize you, your scholarships, academic achievements, and contributions to our high school. Before that, I would like to share an appreciation to the teachers, coaches, parents, grandparents, and other friends and family who have helped you all along the way. Seniors, your class has had a greater impact on me than you might even know. You were all my last class of eighth graders when I had the privilege of teaching at Valley Center Middle School. But if I'm being honest, I mostly remember feeling pretty terrified. Everything was unfamiliar. I had no idea what I was doing or where I was going. And I'm sure many of you can relate to that feeling. Who would have thought that four years later, we would all once again be in a massively unfamiliar, scary situation. However, what got me through was all of you. It was your hugs, your smiling faces, and words of encouragement that helped everything feel not so scary anymore. I find solace in knowing that you are all out there giving the world that same kindness, especially at a time where we need it now more than ever. I thought a lot about the message I wanted to leave you all with, and what continued to be on my heart was the message of not wishing a single moment of your life away, even the difficult ones like right now. You see, these are the moments that truly shape our future selves. When the next time comes that life doesn't go your way, and I hate to be the one to burst your bubble, but this definitely won't be your last and probably not even your toughest hardship, you will have built more perseverance, more resilience, and be able to more gracefully handle whatever lies ahead. While the destinations are absolutely something to celebrate, please don't miss the journey along the way. You will blink and the next big milestone will be here. When you get to that next milestone, it is my wish for all of you that you didn't wait for that one fleeting moment to find joy. Before passing on to Mr. Ray Flora, I would like to leave you all with a quote from L.R. Neust. She writes, life is amazing and then it's awful and then it's amazing again. And in between the amazing and the awful, it's ordinary and mundane and routine. Breathe in the amazing, hold on through the awful and relax and exhale during the ordinary. That's just the heartbreaking, soul healing, amazing, awful, ordinary life. And it's breathtakingly beautiful. Class of 2020, life is so beautiful. Don't miss a moment. Good evening, Hornets. This is Ray Flora, your student body president. And I would like to take the time to address the class of 2020 and congratulate you on your success and achievements throughout Valley Center High School. The class of 2020 has been a special one and being able to grow up alongside you and watch all the accomplishments from athletics to academics, to theatrics, debate, and the various displays of music whether that be instrumental or vocal, has been truly unforgettable. The class of 2020 is filled with it all. And not only that, we flourished because of it. Each and every one of you brought something to the table and contributed to the long lasting legacy that will be the class of 2020. And I know for a class that has always jokingly had 2020 vision, things are looking hazy right now. But I hope you understand that the staff of VCHF has not forgotten about you and are willing to help you in whatever way possible. And I know this isn't how any of us imagined, the final months of our senior year to be, I wouldn't wish it upon any other class. But if there was a class that was so close to one another, so dedicated to the work that they've put in, and so stubborn enough to not let this tear them down, but flip the script and become closer to one another, it would be this class. I wish you all good health and safety as we navigate through this together. And remember, it will forever and always be a great day to be a Hornet. It is now time to share our local scholarship recipients. Alumni Scholarship, Ashlyn Lofgreen and Thomas Posey. Superintendent Scholarship, Gracie Ruth. Riley Greenwood Scholarship, Joshua Dessenberger. VCHS Booster Club Scholarship, Bodie Sad and Ellie Shank. J. Elliott Scholarship, Joshua Dessenberger and Riley Ranzaw. Nurse Nancy Scholarship. Peyton Boone, Eli DeBon, Amber Hayden, Hannah Kirk, Chloe Martins, Lindsay Owings, 
Brayden Rubel, and Jasmine Showmaker. Estella Dawson Scholarship, Megan Brown and Emily Redfield. VCRC Scholarship, Eli DeBon and Riley Ranzaw. Betty Wilbur Scholarship, Jacob Byrne. BC Community Scholarship. Peyton Boone, Amber Hayden. Haven Massey, Kate McDonald. Sophia McNeil, Riley Ranzaw. Bodie Sad, and Kaleo Vincent. Friends of the Library Scholarship. Vanessa Aguilar, Peyton Boone, Megan Brown, Eli DeBon, Cassie Kinneberg, Ashlyn Lofgreen, Wyatt Oliverson, Haven Massey, Kate McDonald, Sophia McNeil, Adrian Miller, Riley Ranzaw, Bodie Sad, Jasmine Showmaker, Ellie Shank, Joey Spratt, and Katara Thompson. We will now celebrate academic honors. Cum laude. These students have achieved a cumulative GPA of 3.5 to 3.699. Magna Cum laude. These students have achieved a cumulative GPA of 3.7 to 3.899. Summa cum laude. These students have achieved a cumulative GPA of 3.9 or above. Please enjoy the presentation of our seniors.
personally congratulate you guys on all of the accomplishments that you guys have accumulated over the years. Um, I know walking into the high school four years ago as a freshman may seem like a long time ago, um, but I know that we've all made lifelong friends and memories along the way. Uh, we've all grown closer uh, with each other uh, through the ups and downs, one of the downs being right now because we can't be with each other. Um, but I encourage you guys to keep in touch with one another, um, just even though it might seem hard right now. Um, even though times have been tough lately, um, I encourage you to reach out to teachers, um, staff, family, uh, friends, if you need anyone to talk to. Um, I'll forever be proud to be a Hornet. Uh, I also wish you guys all the best of luck um, going into your next phase in your life, and stay safe and keep in touch. Hey seniors, Miss Danson here. I just wanted to say congratulations and I'm super duper proud of you guys. You guys are my first class here at BCHS and I'm really sad to see you go. I'm really gonna miss you, but good luck with everything that you have planned in the future and don't be afraid to come back and say hey every once in a while. Congratulations class of 2020. It has been such an honor to have the opportunity to teach a lot of you over the last four years and I'm so proud of you and all of your accomplishments. I know this isn't how you pictured the end of your senior year, but just know that the best is yet to come, and I can't wait to see all that you guys do. Congratulations. Seniors, congratulations. I'm so proud of you. It's been really great getting to know you guys over the past couple of years, and I will miss you so much, but I'm so excited to see what you guys accomplish in the future. Hey, to all you members of the class of 2020, I know it's kind of disheartening that you don't know for sure if you'll have graduation, so I put on a robe in your honor, and I'm very proud of your accomplishments, and I hope that we do get to celebrate all of them in some type of celebration at some point. But if not, just remember, everything you've done was for a reason, and you've got a great start to a great future. Class of 2020, on behalf of Valley Center High School and our entire community, I'd like to congratulate you on the many accomplishments you've achieved, not only these past four years, but throughout your time as a student in USD 262. And I'd like to applaud you for the determination you have demonstrated in overcoming challenges of historic nature. Your leadership, collective efficacy, and perseverance is an inspiration to each of us. And it's those same qualities that we know will lead you to new heights in your future endeavors. We are all so proud of each and every one of you, and we wish you all the best in the years to come. Congratulations, class of 2020. To the class of 2020, some of the most talented, kind, ambitious, creative, and resilient young people I've ever had the privilege to teach and to know. Go forth, continue to be brave, and find those people and things that set your soul on fire. Congratulations. You guys are making history as no one would have ever imagined. You didn't want to. It wasn't in any of our plans, but we're all gonna get through this together. And you guys are gonna go on and succeed like we know all of you will. I just wanna say that I'm proud of all of you. I'm so happy I got to know a lot of you in the different classes that I was in over the last four years that you were there. I hope to see some of you around still, you know, if you come back to Valley or whatever, um, just go out and do your best. We know you will. Uh, shout out to my niece, Ellie. I love you, proud of you. And you guys all take care. Mrs. B's proud of you. To the class of 2020, I want you to know that I think that you are awesome and that you're going to do great things. You guys are resilient, you persevere, and I just want you to keep doing that in whatever you go to do. We know that you're gonna do great things and we look forward to watching you in the future. Congratulations. Hey, class of 2020, I just wanted to reach out and congratulate you on your upcoming graduation and all of your accomplishments. I'm so proud of you guys. Um, I'm really gonna miss you and I know that you guys are gonna do some great things. You guys may not know it, but you are extra special to me because you're the last group of students that I had the opportunity to teach before becoming a counselor. So shout out to all my 
former Spanish students. I miss you guys. Um, I wish you the best. Good luck. Greetings, class of 2020. Mr. Garwood here. Just want to tell you that, uh, first of all, I miss seeing you all every day. Secondly, I just want to congratulate you on everything you've done and the, and the contributions that you've made to this high school over the last four years. Uh, you've definitely made a difference in a lot of ways. And finally, I just want to wish you the very best going forward. Uh, good luck in whatever your endeavors are after you leave uh, Valley Center High School. Take care. Congratulations, seniors. This is Mrs. Sergnato. I'm so glad that I was able to work with you in the library for the last four years. It's been fun working with you on research papers, finding the perfect book for you to read, and helping you return that perfect book. We had career lunches and jigsaw puzzles and checker games and great talks about your future. I just want you to know I'm very proud of you. Come back and see me in the library. Be proud of yourselves for all of your hard work and keep researching, keep reading, and following your dreams. Congratulations, class of 2020. To the class of 2020, I want you to reflect back to your eighth grade promotion in 2016 when I was your middle school principal. The theme of my speech was around a positive attitude, which still holds true today. Remember, life is 10% of what happens to you and 90% of how you react to it. I wish you the best in all of your future endeavors. And remember, once a hornet, Hey always seniors, a hornet. it's Mrs. Carver. I just wanted to tell you how proud I am of you for finishing strong, uh, even in the midst of unusual circumstances. And I'm very excited for you, for your future, and that you get to add this continuous learning as one of your many skills on your resumes. Congratulations. Congratulations, class of 2020. Thank you for your leadership and positive energy all throughout the school. In the words of Mr. Aldemar, life is like a camera. Focus on what's important, capture the good times, and if things don't work out, just take another shot. Good luck in all of your future endeavors. Congratulations, class of 2020. This is definitely an unprecedented year for a most definitely unprecedented graduating class from Valley Center High School. Best of luck to each and every one of you in all of your future endeavors. Hey Hornets, Miss Wine here. I just want to say congratulations on all of your hard work and accomplishments. I know this is a unique time to be graduating, but I really encourage you to lean into this time and make the most of it and continue to be the best that you can be. Congratulations. Hey class of 2020. We just wanted to say that we, we miss you, we're thinking about you, and uh, we wish that things were different. We're so incredibly proud of everything that you've been able to accomplish these past four years, and we wish you the best of luck in the future. In a spring which was supposed to be filled with celebration, traditions, and memories, we found ourselves abruptly stopped and redirected down a path of shock disconnection and loss. Once again, you found new ways to connect, engage, and rise above adversity. Adversity is part of life. You know this, you've mastered the skills needed to face this and overcome it. We've seen you do it time and time again. We've seen it in the classroom. In rehearsal. In the practice rooms or on the field. On the stage. And in performance. Never underestimate the power of the arts. In times of uncertainty and tragedy, the arts bring us comfort, solace, and joy. It reminds us of our shared humanity. We often look to entertainers, musicians, poets, artists to illuminate the shared hope in our lives. And now, we look to you. So be the good in the world around you. You are a gift. Share your gifts with others. Congratulations to the class of 2020.